Monday afternoon, uh, enjoying my day off, just about to have a little planning meeting with my wife, uh, look at the week ahead and all that we're doing. That was about an hour planning the week. And doing that helps us to keep communication open, know what each other's movements are, where we can work together on something, build a great sense of trust and friendship. I remember hearing somebody say a long time ago, um, if you fail to plan, you're planning to fail. Tuesday morning, it's very, very cold out here. Just on my way to the office, full day today. Haven't been out yet, normally go to the gym, but decided to forego the gym so I could get an extended time in reading and praying and building up my spirit because I've got a very full on week with lots of demands and I just felt like I wanted greater energy on the inside. I think that was a good call for me this morning was just reversing out of the drive, look to my side. You're gonna see this beautiful sky this morning. I've been more than six hours of meetings. You can come in, Steve, that's fine. I've been in meetings for about six hours. I've got one more. So I haven't managed to vlog today. Steve has kindly kept me watered with the nice peppermint teas. I'm up for a building meeting. Thanks, Steve. Hello? Hey. Hey there boys, okay. On my way home, it's been an absolutely full day of meetings. These boys have just had drum lessons. And so we're all headed home. That was us breaking bread together. We try and do that most weeks. And we do that to celebrate, remember Jesus dying on the cross, giving his life for us. And through his sacrifice, we have life today. My sister's making fun of me there, so. Hi everyone. Just here to pick up the kids. It's been a really busy day. We did our leadership meal and then came and dropped the kids here halfway through so they could do worship practice. If you haven't been watching my vlogs, you won't know, but every single Tuesday night, I meet with a group of people that I'm in community with. We eat together, we break bread together, we do life together. Um, and I think that's probably finding a group of friends centered around Jesus, doing life together is really, really important to do. Hey. 